Hello, my name is Derek Afasi. I'm the owner of Afasi Financial Group based down here in Tampa, Florida. Today we're going to be discussing the topic of long-term care. When you do not die, you live. Now, that phrase might sound a little ridiculous, but it holds very true. When you live, you become very frail, and it's just a part of life. You may have experienced a long-term care um, condition in regards with your with a loved one, with a spouse, a grandparent, whatever it is, but you understand that they can't necessarily move as well around the house, or maybe they've uh, they've gotten hurt, and and it's ultimately something that it's it's a sort of illness, whether it's going to be Alzheimer's disease or something that's going to be chronic, something that you can't uh, rehab to make better. The way that you gain assistance is whether they determine off of something called ADLs. It's considered activities of daily living. That's eating, bathing, dressing, toileting, transferring, and condiments. Any of those that you need help with when you do become a, an attained age, and you could even have it if you're in your 20s and your teens. If a freak accident happened and you, it results from a chronic illness, you could use long-term care. It's not just meant for, for people in the older generation. A lot of people, when they do need long-term care, they always say, um, and a lot of people associate it too much with nursing home. Oh, I'm just going to be in a nursing home, and you know that's exactly what it covers. Basically, what this is is it's for insurance if you ever need assistance. Eighty percent of people use home health care; they don't use nursing homes. I'll show you the statistics: thirty-one thousand two hundred dollars is paid every year just for a home health care whether that's hospital beds, um, things to, to kind of help you move around throughout your house or health aids, home health aids, different things like that. 20% of the people are going to go to nursing home. That's $85,775 of a national average. A lot of people always say that my kid, my children will take care of me, and you know that, that's all I care about. Getting long-term care at a very inexpensive price, and depending upon you know which company you prefer, there's different things where you have cash payouts, it can give you daily benefits, it can give you monthly benefits, but ultimately it's going to go 100% to the cost of care. Your children, or whoever you have as your caretaker, can take care of you, but they can take care of you at a much better rate. They can observe. They don't necessarily have to have that stress. It's, it's unbelievable the amount of stress it puts on any caregiver. This, this type of long-term care um, and, and just kind of helping and, and, and ultimately always making sure that you do have the proper assistance there because they love you. They understand that. They want you to be taken care of as, as, as best as possible. A lot of people say, Medicare covers it. That's fine. We're good. They're completely wrong. Like I said before, long-term care covers chronic illness. Medicare covers something called acute illness. Acute means it's at a re rehabilitative stage. You fall down, you break your leg. They'll go and they'll say, okay, Medicare will cover you. They'll put you in a hospital, a rehab facility for X amount of days, and you know, it could change every year. Once that turns chronic, once they say, hey, there's nothing more we could do for this leg, we're, never, we're not going to pay for a cost of care. That's not long-term care. It's acute services, something that's temporary. Chronic is something you could have, a, it could be a cognitive impairment, such as Alzheimer's disease. It could be something of, you know, you have uh, displaced hips, you can't walk around as well, you just can't necessarily move as well as you were before, and you need this cost of care. You need, you need that extra help. It's, it's definitely good to, to pick up when you are in your 50s, your 60s, but there's different things out there. A lot of people, they're working all their years for retirement. Once they're in retirement, everything with retirement is going very well. They want to make sure that they're having some sort of retirement. And they're also leaving a sort of legacy out there as well. They don't want to see everything that they work for going to the cost of care. So what this does is it's just a lot easier way to do it. It protects you for living too long. Everybody wants to live too long. Everybody understands different medical devices out there, technological advances out there that are going to allow you to live so long. Um, you know, your situation is going to be different. It depends upon state, there's certain restrictions, uh, certain capabilities, um, so just give us a call. Your situation is obviously different, and to get help with your specific situation, call us our toll-free number. You can email us 24 hours a day, seven days a week, and someone will get back to you. Or you can even set up a video conference where you can see our faces, 
we can understand, we'll, we'll make sure that we sit down, that we break down all the intricacies of what you want to know. We have literature pieces, we have video tutorials. This is going to be for the generalized information, but we want to make sure that you're as educated as possible. We mold a situation to your designated plan. Once again, my name is Derek Afasi, and I thank you for watching this video.